When students are given their prompt for writing and their task, the first thing that they need to do is plan their ideas. So I'm going to show you how to plan five minutes into the paper, showing your audience, purpose, genre, and then a brief outline of your ideas. So the first thing I'm going to do is read through the prompt and make sure I understand it. Write an article for parents advising them on how to get their children to follow a healthier lifestyle. There are three things that we need to notice and they're highlighted. The first thing is that it's an article. So I'm going to make a note that this is my genre. And in this genre, I need to make sure that I'm using fact and opinion because it's an article. I also need to be sure that it's easy to read. I also need to remember that sometimes we can use images and captions to pull out key ideas. And finally, I need to use clear headings. So if I make this note to myself right away at the beginning, I know exactly what kind of piece I'm going to be writing. The second thing I need to remember is who I'm writing for. So the next thing I'm going to notice is my audience. And this particular task gives me a very specific audience. My audience is parents. So I need to be able to appeal to them by talking about what it means to be a good parent. So I'm going to appeal to good parenting techniques. Okay. My next thought is how am I going to get them to be motivated to make a change? So I'm going to use maybe the approach of what's best for the child. And keeping my audience in mind will shape the language that I use in my article. The third thing I need to know is the purpose. Okay, and the purpose here is how to get their children to follow a healthier lifestyle. And we do that by advising. So my third note over here is my purpose. Okay? And I know that I need to do four things whenever I write to advise. I need to remember remember to do use modal verbs. I need to use imperatives. I need to use personal pronouns. And I need to use a formal tone. So I'm going to tell them what to do by using my modals and imperatives. And I'm going to make it personal for them by referring to I and you and we. Now, the next thing I need to do is take a look at the subject matter, okay? How to get their children to follow a healthier lifestyle. And I need to do that by making a four-part outline. In the first bit, I'm going to state the problem. Okay? And our problem is that there are too many children in Britain and in most industrialized countries around the world that are becoming obese. The second thing I need to do is give advice. I need to tell parents how their children can avoid the problem of childhood obesity and have healthier lifestyles. And I'm going to suggest a few key ideas. I'm going to suggest that parents model healthy behavior. This way I'm appealing directly to the parents and I'm giving them things that they personally can do. The second thing I'm going to do is make sure that it's positive. And I'm going to tell them to focus on what you can have and what you can do and not just make it negative. And the third thing that I'm going to do is advise them to offer incentives to their kids because children love incentives. The third thing here in my outline is going to be to state the benefits of following my advice. And here I'm going to reiterate the importance of having healthy children and why following my advice will make them have a healthier family as well. And finally, before I conclude my article, I'm going to offer hope for success, that if they follow all the steps that I've advised, that their children will be healthier. So just to wrap it up, you need to do three things first. You need to find out your genre and write notes to yourself. You need to identify your audience and you need to identify your purpose. Then finally, give yourself a four-part plan, and that should be five minutes into your writing to advise paper.